I'm not going to tire looking at this news report in a hurry, uh, especially after uh, last episode. But yeah, welcome back to my World Cup adventure, my World Cup jaunt, whatever it's called. Um, this is the episode where we go to the semi-finals of the 2018 World Cup in Football Manager 2018. We are managing Argentina. Last episode, we got an insane penalty shootout win against England. If you haven't seen that, like I don't usually plug videos, because what's the point? But genuinely, the last episode was absolutely insane. I would recommend watching it. I've not edited it yet, but I, I'm guessing it was insane based on the fact the game was insane. It's, you, it's been spoiled to you, but still. Um, anyway, we have a game against Brazil in four days in the World Cup semi-final. I genuinely did not expect to get this far, especially after having to get through a group containing Spain, uh, getting past Germany in the second round. We beat England in the quarterfinals. Now we're up against Brazil. It's been no easy test at all, but... You know, we've come this far, let's just see how much further we can get. So, what I'm going to do actually is, let's go to second round, go to three. So yeah, Brazil beat the US and Russia to get this far. Uh, we beat England and Germany. So we've had the harder time. Are Brazil as good as they once were? I mean, they've got Neymar. I just don't know if they're as good as they once were, but who knows. Anyway, let's continue. Um, we are missing, I think we will be missing a few key players. Mascherano reaches yellow card limit, Messi to miss semi-final. I mean, they said that about the second round or something like that, but he ended up making it. He's played every game so far. All right, here we go. Injury update. Messi's only going to be out for another two days, it looks like. Di Maria's completely out for the next game. All right, here we go. First semi-final. Um, so we will be playing one of these teams, uh, because obviously, if, even if we lose, there is the third and fourth place uh, playoff. Um, but if we win... This is who we'll be playing in the final. Belgium, yeah, I would I would have suspected it would have been Belgium. Um, judgment day for Argentina, yep. I was just thinking that this tactical briefing that I just skipped, think of how useless that would have been against England, because I would have, imagine I did the tactical briefing, then we went into the game and the guy got sent off after three minutes. I would have had to change it all, so the tactical brief briefing would have been redundant. So yeah, it's just just goes to show that anything can happen. Board are pleased with our management of the team. That is good. Wait, they're pleased with the tactics. Here we go then. Semi-final day against uh, Brazil. So they've had a strong... It looks like they got strong form. We're inconsistent. I mean, we did win the last game, but it counts it as a draw. Um, we have lost at this World Cup. I don't think they have, judging by the form. They are favourites as well. So the question is, what do we do? Do we play more defensively? Because, I mean, oh no. Oh, okay, so two suspensions. Messi's not injured, which is good. But we're losing, we've lost three key players. Two to suspension and one to injury. Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to turn this guy into an anchor man on defence. He's competent at that. This guy can be a ball-winning midfielder on support. He's competent at that. So, yeah, that should be fine. Um, as for the fullbacks, go they, they, they threaten a lot down the right-hand side, so we'll have Gomez as a fullback on defend, whereas we'll try and link up the play here. Although they might be threatening down that side as well. I'm not really sure, to be honest. I mean, it's not a bad lineup. It's just not our strongest one. Also, Messi's... Has a very poor morale for some reason. No idea why. I'm not sure I want to know why, but there you go. Um, maybe he's maybe he's upset that we're going to get knocked out against Brazil. I mean, to be fair, I thought we'd get knocked out in the last 16 to Germany, and we didn't. I thought we'd get knocked out in the quarterfinal, especially after three minutes against England, and we didn't. Um, so anything's possible. I thought we'd easily cream Jamaica, and we uh, we only just got through against them. Uh, but yeah, that's what we're gonna have to go for, isn't it? Yeah, we'll go for that. That's the same sort of line setup. It's the same sort of setup we had against Germany, and we'll just have to see what Brazil do. We can change our tactics as we get there, but we're gonna stick with the same back four. All right, warm ups are happening. There is a fair overall mood. One or two players appear to be distracted. We should ask the team to do it for the fans. Let's give the fans something to cheat about. Yeah, they gain confidence. That's good. Did Messi gain confidence? No. He listened keenly, though. Uh, but otherwise, everyone's pl ev everyone's pr in pretty good spirits. Uh, let's set some opposition instructions. There we go. Right. Let's go. So there's a lot of Brazilian... Seems to be mainly Brazilian fans in the ground, which is interesting. Mainly yellow people. I mean, like, not yellow people, but people in yellow strips. Anyway, uh, here we go. Neymar, first touch of the ball. 
What's he going to do? He just drives at the defence. That is insane. Messi looks unsure. What are you looking at unsure for, mate? Are you unsure? This is this is the match you got to do it in. Oh, I don't believe in that guy. He's so frustrating. Oh, please don't score. Uh, Neymar just cannoned the ball into a bunch of uh, players. Here's Messi. He's played it back to the keeper. I feel like he's going to fail to perform today. Sorry that I don't have faith in my star man, but I'm sure you can understand if you've been watching this. Let's try and keep hold of the ball. Yeah, that's right. Just get away from Neymar. Neymar and Messi are playing the same wing. Oh, good. Good pass. Coutinho just intercepted. He's not being marked at all. Neymar's driving at the defence. It's been cut out. He doesn't seem to play on the wing much, does he? Yeah, he seems to be the one that they just they all want to pass to. Neymar then with a shot. Firmino is through, but... No idea what happened there. Um, that's a long ball down to Messi. Sandro got up there. I think that's Sandro anyway. Yeah, Sandro. Alex Sandro. Oh, wait, he was in the team last time, I remember, in the, the, the 2014 game. Long shot. All right, we're actually we're not making too much ground, so we've got to have a look at our analysis. Brazil are probably looking to control the game because they know they've... Oh, here we go, Diabala. Please, please score, please score. Oh, my gosh. That was just... Oh, foot race here. Oh, he made it. Big Liam made it. Good job. Right, here we go, Gomez. Ball to Dybala. Get the ball across, Messi. He's played it to that guy, and he just flashed wide. <laughs> I said that guy, I think that was like the full back or something that we brought in. Here we go, another free kick. Danny Alves' foul caused. It's a ball, and it ended up absolutely nowhere. Coutinho is on the run. Gomez. Don't... What? Don't keep it in! What an absolute doofus! Why would you keep it in when the other guy's clearly going to get it and then just, just let it roll out? Okay, whatever. Oh, wait, what's this? We should encourage our players to play a short passing game. That wasn't working, though. Neymar with the corner. Aguero manages to get it away. Casemiro back into the mix where Neymar is. He's got the cross across to continue as well, Ian, and it's 1-0 Brazil. Oh, it was only a matter of time, wasn't it? It was only a matter of time. I've not beaten Brazil. I've played Brazil... This is the third time I've played Brazil in this series. I've managed them, but I've never played... I've played them three times and I've lost twice. This is probably the best chance I have of winning, to be honest with you. It's raining at the minute, actually. Here's Casemiro. Into Coutinho. Plays it to Neymar, and it's 2-0. It's that easy. It was that easy. All right, I've just changed our mentality to attack. Oh, it's it's a nightmare. It's a nightmare. So they've scored two in such quick succession. Yeah, just make the t make the changes. I mean, I like how it tells me that, but it's kind of annoying. Yeah, I think they'll probably just want to hold back now. Okay, here we go. I mean, we've had chances. It's not like they've been on top. I mean, they have been on top, but we have had chances. He's passed it in. Come on, Messi turn. Messi, and it's, it's a corner kick. Right, so here we go. It's time for... Uh, Biglia to swing it in. Ball swing in Otamendi and it's straight at Alson. Come on, just easy passes. Ball to Guero. He's lost it. Yep, Casemiro's just scooped it up. And they've just played it straight to Neymar. Good stuff. Good challenge. Nice challenge there by, uh, I don't know, don't know who that was, but we can appreciate it at least. Of oh, oh wow, wow, your time, and he just smacked it down to a Brazilian. Fernandinho, come on, just flip and get, get tackling, don't let him score, good cha challenge, Firmino's round, and he just missed a sitter. It wasn't much of a sitter, but whatever. Gomez now, play the ball down, Otamendi, just, just find an easy pass, you could have played about five hours earlier and it would have been more advantageous. Otamendi to Dybala. I didn't change the formation, did I? I did change it and then I undid it. Here we go, come on. Ball into the middle. Ball into the middle. And it looks like it's a corner, that's good. Let's see if we can get a goal from this right before half time. They intercepted it. Pizarro's going to pick it up. There we go. Let's uh, get into the dressing room. One of two players seem to be distracted. Seems disenchanted. The twit. It's probably your fault that we're 2-0 down. It's not really his fault. 
Let's give the fans something to cheat about. I'm giving this guy a, ch a talk. No pressure. Didn't seem to work. Uh, should we? T we might have to take off Aguero. I think we're going to change tactics here. Change focus. Um, Acuna, we can. He can stay out there. Can Dybala play there? Can he? No, he can't. We're going to have to take him off, which is unfortunate because he's been playing well. Oh, he's not really been playing well. Um, Pizarro. Pizarro's going to play over here. Central defense, box to box midfielder, I guess. Why not? Biglia. Deep line playmaker. I would take Messi off, but it's Messi, so I can't really do that. Alright, we're just going to have to go for it at this point. Um, Aguero is playing slightly deeper. Not sure if that's a good thing, but either way, we're just going to have to do it. Uh, let's give our final team talk to Dybala. Oh wait, Dybala's off. Who's the guy that came on? It's this guy. This is it. Final half of... Well, no, it's not a final half of football, but it's it's the half of football that we need to make count to keep us in the in, in the tournament. This is for a place in the final, guys. Come on. Oh, here we go. Messi finds Pizarro. Come on, just play across. Play across. Out wide. What are you doing? It's probably because they've got bad decision making. Biglia. Just find an easy pass. Oh, he's, he's played him in. He's played it through to Messi. 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 Oh, he scored. He's not on. He's, he's on side. So that is... A goal back for us in the World Cup semi-final. Hopefully we can get another one. Brazil are still dangerous. We'll probably concede again, to be honest. Here's Marquijos. Can't pronounce that name, I'm sorry. I feel like I should. All right, so we're coming forward now with more attacking potency. Just kidding. We're probably going to lose the ball in a minute. There we go. Come on, just take him on. Take the full back on. Oh, come on. Early cross. Just play it back to him. Play it. Oh, don't give it to them. Ball back to Alson. Thiago Silva. Yeah, they're just going to pass their way out of there because they can do that. Here's Neymar now. He's so fast into Firmino. Please save it. Good save. Good save by the keeper. Right, come on. Just, he's, he's just so fast. It's insane. Fernandinho. Needs to find Coutinho. He does. But we've got the ball back. Right, okay. Here's Messi. Rides one challenge. But runs straight into a brick wall. Well, what's Neymar? He's not going to do that, is he? No, he's, he's going to find a pass. I should probably tell him to dribble less. Anyway, here's Willian. Ball in the middle for Mino, and it's 3-1. That could be the sucker punch. Ah, I, uh, It was inevitable that we were going to concede. I know that's defeatism, but we, we still need two goals. Right, we need the two goals before. We still need two goals. Nothing's changed. Although Brazil are clearly finding their feet. Ball in the middle. This is what could get me sacked, to be honest with you. It is a heavy defeat to Brazil. Firmino finds Neymar. Brazil are just on another level to England, let's be honest with you. Ball down to Messi. Messi's going to run at the defence, as he usually does. Here's Aguero. Aguero stops and loses it. On the edge of the area. Fantastic. It's coming back though. Come on. Easy ball. Easy ball into Aguero. He's passed in. And it's a good save there by the keeper. Look, oh, there's a screen over there that kind of shows the game. Anyway, we've got a corner here. Alright, one of their players was cautioned. Who's got the ball? I can't even see it. Oh, there it is. Gomez. Chance. Come on, turn. He's played it in. Ball in the middle. Oh, he's offside. Yeah. I was pretty sh convinced of that. Would have been nice to get a second goal though, make it 3 2. And anyway, here's Alson. Plays it to Thiago Silva. They're just going to go down the other end and score now, watch. Oh, good good challenge. Come on, come on. Tons of people up in support. Plays it to Aguero. Aguero. He's offside. Why did he stop? Oh, he just gave it away now. And we're caught short because we got like four men behind the ball or in front of the ball. Aguero plays it in. Tries to chip it to Messi. It's Pastore. Oh, good save. That was close. We've got a corner now, though. Hopefully it goes somewhat better than our previous attempts. No, Thiago Silva's just standing there. Ball back in. Big Leah. Just take a shot, man. I don't care. Rojo. That's not a good position to be a centre-back. Trying to shield the ball from two Brazilians. I told you. Unfortunately, it's on our half, which is not ideal. Fanger. Oh, 
He's got a ball there, but it was intercepted before it could reach Aguero. Here's Messi, though. Just play ball over the top for him. Yep, good pass. Oh, oh. He's off, surely. Come on. Come on, that has to be a red. Not just going to make a difference, because I doubt we can score even one in four minutes. Yeah, he's off. Clip ball into Casemiro. Thiago Silva takes the kick. Oh, it's off the post. And it's still in play, yes. Good tackle, good tackle. Get there, get there. Just get it downfield, get it downfield. There's two guys on that wing. Surely it'll arrive at one of them, right? We're streaming forward now. Long ball to Messi. Come on. Take off oh, for crying out loud. I think he had more time. That was the chance. That was the chance. Confirm changes. Alexandro. Ball in the middle. Oh, that almost went all the way through. And that's it. Oh, no. Yep, no, that is it. All right. Well, yeah, performance was disappointing. I don't think the pro... I mean, some people's performances was disappointing. Cough, cough, Aguero. Okay, yeah, we'll just do that one. Leave it at that. So, that's us out of the World Cup, uh, unfortunately. Um, yeah, Brazil was just too strong for us. I mean, I think, I think we could have done it better. If we'd taken our chances, then it would have been a different story, but... Of course, well, we've got one game left, the third place playoff. So I think I'm going to end the game there, uh, end the episode there. Um, we'll have one more episode, it'll be episode 20, so we'll get 20 episodes out of this series. Um, and next episode, obviously, we'll just go into the uh, third place playoff game against uh, Switzerland. Aguero is hit by an injury and he's out for eight days, which probably means he misses it. Not that it makes a difference because we've got Higuain and Icardi on the bench. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, thank you very much for watching. Apologies we couldn't go any further, but these things happen. Uh, I will see you next time.